Hey everyone, it's your girl Angie. I'm here today with some special guests. As you see, a very Daddy, special Daddy. one. Oh gosh, a very very <laughs> special one here. Um, we're gonna be <laughs> we're gonna be talking about an upcoming event that is for our youth. So I thought it would be nice to have my my baby on today. Um, the Oh, okay. <laughs> She's waving. Um, so, an evening among Young Stars Awards. I'm not sure if anyone has seen it coming out. We've been sharing it. It is this Sunday, and it is going to be a grand time. So, we are looking forward to an awesome event. Oh, God. So, this wasn't a good one. <laughs> So she, so she's ready for the stars, um, but but we have on the show today. Okay, no, 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 no. Oh, no, this is not a good one. So we have on the show, um, yes, we have on the show a visionary for the awards. Um, for the Evening Among Young Stars Awards, Miss Erica. We also have the keynote speaker. Um, with us, Joni. So many of you all know Joni from Heart Smiles. So we're looking forward to a wonderful um, event that is going to be going on this Sunday. So this is a, this is this show is really just, <laughs> but it's all good. It's, it just shows you um, that our youth are still imp they're important, and no matter what, they they're just a, a grand to have in our presence and to invest back into them. So. There are many things that we can talk about, but at first I want to just hear from Ms. Erica, who is the visionary of this event, and what prompted you to even start such an amazing award show for it? Um, so back in, I want to say October 2015, I had lost my best friend, and her I daughter is my goddaughter. Oh, okay. So to continue on with her legacy and the love that she showered over her daughter and how she, you know, wanted to make sure that her daughter was always supported and uplifted during their circumstances, it came the idea of doing mm -hmm. an award ceremony. So it's just basically like a tribute to Wonderful. her. Wonderful. And what's the age um, group for it? So the age group initially started from 11 to 17. Mm -hmm. It's <laughs> <So> initially. <laughs> initially. <laughs> but now it's 9 to 17. Oh, okay. So we expanded mm. it, yeah, um, because we got a lot of feedback from our little ones. Uh-huh. Um, so we did. Did, did you catch them. the one from the uh, Boys and Men seminar? He was young. Mm -hmm. No. I did, I seen him. Yeah, he, he was wonderful. Next year. Next year. <laughs> yeah, next year. <laughs> Listen, I love I love the fact that the next year is even in place. Yeah, girl, the, we got the date. Annual. So this is the first annual. <laughs> Second annual, we have a date already. Yes. <laughs> And Miss Joni, I mean, anytime we talk about the youth, we just always got to make sure that she's involved <laughs> in it. She's doing some amazing things in Baltimore City with our youth. Um, anything going on? First of all, just before Ms. I don't want to, I don't want to miss, I don't want to miss any of your upcoming. <laughs> but she is all she. I probably already said this. She's gonna be the keynote speaker. She's gonna have yes, an amazing, 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 uh, a word of encouragement to our young scholars. I mean, it's times where I have, I'm having problems, and just her all calming voice is just so like amazing. So just to have someone for our youth such as yourself involved and investing thank, thank you. you thank you so much i guess i gotta do a good job now, now yes. oh, well, you, you, gotta, you have to continue <laughs> you, sure yeah. you, you already on it so I, I already raised the bar really high for you <laughs> so. Yo, but I, I really do appreciate erica for tapping me for it because i know that um it's very prestigious i know that it means a lot to her she mm -hmm. could have chosen anyone and there are a lot of people public figures who are going to be attending this event so um to be chosen for that particular role i i really do appreciate it and i yes. don't take it lightly no, at all no yeah we are excited so this sunday yes. february the 11th at langston mm -hmm. hoods what is it? I'm Community so resource and I know it's like a it's business. Here. Okay, get it right. Get it right. Get it right. <laughs> Community Sorry. Business and resources. Yes. Yes. We not having no yes. <laughs> so this Sunday at four, we're gonna be giving out. I know you had you. First of all, she's been surprising me every time I look at. It, I'm like, oh, okay, okay, special guests in the building. Yeah. So yes. who, who who can we expect and what can we expect? 
Man, we, we got a lot of people. <laughs> I know, I know. When, every time I see it, I'm like, I get so excited. Oh, God, God. The baby got my iPad. Oh, uh, no, oh. No, but she actually can have, probably switch. Um, <laughs> we have the mayor coming. We have Senator, uh, Senator Barbara Robinson coming. Um, State's Attorney Marilyn Mosby coming. Of course, yourself and Joni, uh, Mr. Mitchell. We have Rashad Stanton from Baltimore City mm-hmm. Public School mm-hmm. Systems. Um, Good guy. They're coming. Um, hey, this is a lot of people. <laughs> I have uh, Chef Nicole Mooney from Black Girls Inc. Incorporated. She has a nonprofit here in Baltimore City who teaches young girls how to cook. And mm-hmm. they have, like, it's a big program. It's not just about mm-hmm. cooking. They do a oh, lot yeah, of yeah. things with STEM and mm-hmm. leadership skills and things like that. Um, and then we have Keanu Williams. So mm-hmm. she's going to be have a poet recite. Ooh. There. So, yeah, I'm really snap, excited. Snap, snap. Yes, ma'am. I, I love poetry. Yes, yes. Can, yes. I, can I just give Rashad a quick shout out, though? Because yes. he has BCPS in his email, Ooh. but he has the streets.com in his blood. I know that's so right. It is really we nice. We did a show together, an uh, interview. It's yes. really nice to, to have someone Ooh. who really cares about the community and cares about the youth mm-hmm. who is yeah. actually in the seat of power. Yeah, so shout out to like him for everything he's been doing. Yeah, he's been on top of it with me um, about everything. <laughs> my, our work emails is dinging. Like, right? <laughs> I was out last week from being sick, and then when I got back to work, he had sent his information over. So I was like, okay, now I'm going to go back and redo the yeah. file. Like, <laughs> make sure everybody gets, you know, their yeah. recognition because it's not. Mm-hmm. I mean, it's, it's it's about the kids, but mm-hmm. it's also about the community. And it's mm-hmm. about showing that everybody from all different categories and walks of life and titles can all come together to support the right. youth. So that's just the point. Well, I'm excited to hear the additional special guests. I didn't see I didn't hear about all yeah, of it. So, from everybody, so this right? is this is good. This is good. It's good. And so this went out to uh, Baltimore City Public Schools. Mm-hmm. And um, we have uh, individuals that will be awarded for great good grades. Eleven. Oh, Eleven. Wow. Look 11. at that. And then, well, it'll be a total of probably about thirteen or fourteen. Because mm-hmm. even if the kids who did not get plaques or the actual awards, mm-hmm. they'll still get certificates. Okay. So we still Aww. wanted them to feel included and not feel left out. First so annual. It's still trying. <laughs> <laughs> yes, it's the first one. But, you know, we try to make sure everybody feels comfortable with mm-hmm. love and supported. So, you know, whether they want or not, they still going to get something. Yes. Well, I am definitely excited to uh, see the smiles on the faces of the babies. Um, I, one of the things I've been hearing over and over is that not so much that and I hope I hope I don't take this out, but we do a lot of investing in the ones that are at risk and that are not doing well. And we kind of sometimes miss the ones that are doing well. And so we want them to know that they are appreciated just as much and they're just as important. Like money, everything kind of goes into the bad, you know. Yeah. But um, the ones that are doing, not to say is overlooked, but that's what I've been hearing often. So it's kind of good. It's good to have your um, award uh, show go on to show that for the ones that are doing good and exceptional in school. Yep. And it's, you know, it's also to give a different outlook on what it is to be successful. Mm-hmm. Like, you don't have to be mm-hmm. an all-star athlete, Absolutely. go to the NBA, you know, there's Absolutely. other roles that you can take and skills and talents that mm-hmm. we can tap into Absolutely. To spark like them thinking in other different light than just being on TV and being a celebrity. Yeah. Cause that don't the first thing I'm is like. sports, right? <laughs> yeah, exactly. You know, yeah. so we get all of that investing in there, but uh, when it comes to your like academic, it's just not as much. Even vocational, Cause a lot of programs are getting taken out of schools mm. now. Yes, yes, yes. The one yes. that ain't get took is sports and <laughs> Yes. <laughs> one of the things I was looking at was, um, how art now we fought for that it, it wasn't happening at Marvel, but i do know that that was kind of the first things your 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 gym or oh, i don't know what they call it physical education your um your art like these are things that kind of can be used that's why i love stem because you're using all of that but still incorporating some fun into mm-hmm. it that's how you're going to get our children to even be engaged yeah. in that so yeah. kudos to um all that's going to happen this sunday 
Yes, ma'am. I'm so excited. Yes, yes. So she has me as a host, Lord Jesus. <laughs> but you um, I am excited to. Oh, thank you. Look at you making my day. She made my day. Now you make my day. <laughs> so I am. Um, I, I'm looking at. You know, just just our young people, period. It's just That's amazing right. to see so much talent in Baltimore City. Yeah. And I know with Joni, I know you see a lot of, I'll be seeing, like, first of all, let me tell you, that picture I saw you on the uh, desk. Which <laughs> said, one? Oh, which one? <laughs> <laughs> oh, hey, excuse me. I looked at it and I said, I just love her. Like I love, and and they see that, you know, they see that they're gonna see this from the war show. They see the ones that can act silly, just like you know, with them. But you're just, you just love them, you know. And and kudos to you. And any upcoming things that you have going on, you know, let us know so we can support it. Of course. Oh, wait a minute, tomorrow. Look at this. Meet me at Matthew A. Henson at six o'clock. But this is something that I don't Wait normally do. Wait I'm only doing it by request. <laughs> so for, for people who want to learn about business one on one. Like that, that, yeah. that person that's maybe thinking about starting a small that. business, but they may just not, you know, understand what some of the steps may be. Mm-hmm. That that person that really hasn't Can you really do taken the first few steps. <laughs> yeah, this, is, yeah, th- th- this is the basis of yes. the basis. So if you've already started your own thing, this may not necessarily be for you. But help me. if you are help in me, those help us. infancy stages, we're going to have a lot of fun. We're going to give a lot of great information, a lot of great resources. And this was something that the community requested from me because I don't normally do that. Mm-hmm. You know, I've been lucky per se, blessed really, that God, you know, just kind of put me in a position to be able to do all the things that I've been able to do with my business in such a short time. Right. So, um, and people recognize that, but I never put myself out there as that. Right. So they're like, look, Joni, the leadership and everything is great and all mm-hmm. that, but show uh-huh. us how to start some businesses. Tell and us entrepreneurship. Yeah. So yeah. entrepreneurship with kids. Is, so this yeah. will be my first yes. time, you know, really kind of taking it serious from an adult so, perspective. Oh, okay. Was this for adults? Okay. Yep. 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 So this yes. is for adults. Yeah. Kids are welcome, but this is mainly going to be focused on um, adults. So yeah, the things you're doing with our youth. I mean, I've seen how you've created, uh, I say created, they've created, but you've allowed the, 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 the knowledge to just trickle down where their businesses are now like blossoming yeah. you've taken them down to the department of assessment and taxation and got their business just registered so like <laughs> just I, when i see that like i said entrepreneurship is like something that we all we all can do it you know mm-hmm. and yeah. it's and it's a is this a sense of ownership to say that is yours you know mm-hmm. and it's something that is a a part of our youth, they are so, like, just like I said, they are so amazing that they all have it. Yes. You know, like, look at the game now you had. I mean, uh, everyone, you know, the, the youth, yeah, the photography, the everything, you yeah, know, absolutely. they had it. And it was amazing. Absolutely. <laughs> and once you put that seed DJ inside of them, ch- ch- it's amazing, like, what they can do afterwards because yeah. it does something to your mindset mm-hmm. and when i'm talking to my kids especially when i'm first meeting them that's all i want i yeah. want for you to leave out of this thing with a different mindset Absolutely. knowing that whatever i'm doing i'm doing it because i want to mm-hmm. i'm working this job for a reason mm-hmm. purposely with intent because i want to not because i'm stuck here and because yes. i have to mm-hmm. go in that baby Ooh, front line no. position yes, thinking ma'am. like a ceo mm. yeah that's what I did. Yeah. That's what I did today. That's what I did today. You know, we had to tell him, Johnny. We had to tell. Sometimes we gotta tell the devil, like, "Hey, I'm a CEO. Like, who are you? Exactly. You don't tell me what to do. Right. So you seek it. <laughs> right. you seek it. Yep. And so we gotta make sure, even with them, like, sometimes it's so much going on in the city and and in their neighborhoods. Mm-hmm. Like, we 
oh, the news. I don't know whatever they're looking at. Like it's yeah. so much that we look. I'm gonna. I'm getting ready to put them out. <laughs> <laughs> but it's so much I'm going on baby, baby, like, that baby. we must continue to show them that there is a way yes. and you can do it. Yes. You know, you don't have to have 50 million degrees. In fact, you don't even have to have one. And I'm not, I'm not, not and I'm not I saying you have to have one because, because yep. my it's daughter important. better finish college. <laughs> <laughs> But you don't yeah. have to have all these things. Like I, it really bothers me when you got when when people feel like you got to have all these, you know, credentials. You have to do X, Y, Z for what? You mm-hmm. know, and it's not even like your ideas and your work. Yeah. So you gotta just continue to just live that dream. And these two years, you y'all, y'all living y'all dream, and I love it. I love it. I don't know. I just had this mindset of just not giving up. Like, not I didn't go up. to college. I mean, I go to college now, mm-hmm. but I didn't go when I got out of high school. Like, I went and worked and did what I had to do to get to this point, but I don't regret it. Mm-hmm. Like, it's not something that I look back and say, oh, I'm not successful. Right. Or, you know, I'm not mm-hmm. happy with where my life is because of me not going to school. Because right. a lot of blessings came even out of that. So Absolutely. you got to be grateful. Absolutely. Absolutely. And how your journey took. Yeah. So we're not saying don't. <laughs> Definitely not saying <laughs> but, don't. But, no, not but, saying but don't. we acknowledge that it's not for everyone. <laughs> but so be like, okay, if it don't. Go absolutely. That way. Because one of the things is, oh my gosh, yeah. <laughs> one of the things is, I love with like uh, vocational schools is that you pick a trade and and it uh, they understand that not everyone is college, yes. you know, mm-hmm. material here. But you can still do a lot of things that um, can still make a difference, still can be beneficial Absolutely. without Absolutely. that. And it, it, it's some people that get those degrees and don't even use and them. And don't use it. It's so I many people like friends. that. Yeah. My baby changed her major, and I said, you change it again. It's going to be a problem. But then I thought about it. Mm-hmm. And I said, you got to do what you mm-hmm. yep. what you feel and have a passion and love for. Let me tell you, shout out to my baby because she is going to um, Thursday. Today. Yeah, Thursday. She's going to be um, auditioning for, um, I don't even know what they would call it, but uh, a radio show that's on campus. Awesome. And she's going to be hosting That's it. Good. That's awesome. um, talking now about don't talking about too career. Far from your trio, but man. listen, but listen, I try to get her on the show. She don't want to come. <laughs> What's up with that? I try, Mommy, like. I try to get her to come out in the community <laughs> with me. She don't. What's but up with she, that? But you doing all this stuff on, on campus. I love she it. Mom. That's pressure. Yeah. Like, how you gonna sit next to the host and you trying to be a host? Like, well, I told her, I told life. her summertime or when you know school is out, I want her to come on and co-host or host a show. That'd be awesome. Yeah. So I'm and and in. we're just pushing pushing our youth and pushing our young people. So you know, let me call youth, pushing our young adults. We gotta show them the way. That's the same with like um, even with. The thing that gets me with, like, politicians is that we always have to make sure that we are handing something down to our youth. Mm-hmm. And what we're seeing now is things are what they call it, career politicians. Things are not being handed down because they feel like I'm going to lose my, my, my thing, you know. Mm-hmm. So they're not doing, they're not handing down. We got to make sure that we hand down these things. Mm-hmm. And if she get another piece of candy. Mm-hmm. Um, <laughs> so we, we have to make sure that we hand down <laughs> the knowledge, the power, the 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 uh you know your roots the things that I know with my grandmother she handed down a lot of stuff my father handed down a lot of things you know yeah. so it's so it's things that we could be doing even if it's not blood you know if it's not family so that's why I said yeah. with you all you, you're doing it you know and you just don't have that no more you know no. Like growing up no. with, well back in the day old fashioned. There was big mama, there was auntie, there was uncles, you know, there was cousins. Now there's young mamas. Like, <laughs> young <laughs> young <laughs> grandmas. <laughs> like those old-fashioned <laughs> But it's the truth. Like, yeah. it's not this the is my, same. This is my no face more. because my child has paper on the floor. But I will get it, Uncle, Uncle <laughs> Don McKay. <laughs> but this is, this is our, our you. Let me help you. Say she the future you too It's gonna be the future Yeah right. For sure <laughs> Yeah some, Sometimes y'all gonna see me out there But the thing is Thank We gotta you. make sure that we, You're welcome She got manners Today I just I don't know like, <laughs> so, For me I just can't imagine Sitting in the house at 65 
and not feeling any type of confidence in the mm -hmm. the person who's going to be taking care running of you, next, basically, <laughs> or, or like, taking care, yeah, or taking care of you. <laughs> like they're yeah. the next one, so yeah. you have to pass down all yeah. the knowledge and experience. Someone said that. And Someone said that it. Me. Derek. Derek said that. He's like, if you can look at. You look at young, you know, some young guys or girls, and you just look at them and say, I don't think I want them to take care of you. Then you know it's more for you to do. Yep. And you yep. just got to try and show them the way. Yeah. There ain't nothing to, to reach out and help. Mm-hmm. Like, yeah, I don't. Mm, mm. So some some, some today, I, I I went to the school, did a little pop-up, and I was like, you in a, did you go to class? What's your trade? Nursing. Oh, oh how are you going to do X, Y? You know, so just, yeah. you know, and they, oh, oh, oh. You know, <laughs> but they, but actually they they enjoy. Mm -hmm. They might not. They might talk about me. They might call me names, but they <laughs> respect. No they respect me when I'm there, and I do believe that they enjoy someone coming and talking to them, and 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 you know putting them putting them on the spot. You For know, sure. in a sense, For you know, sure. because they may not be getting it at home. And kids, I mean, back in my day, I don't know if it's just because my parents and my family was strict, but they was always saying kids love discipline, yeah. even though they discipline. may not like it. Yes. When you're telling them, pull your pants up. Love structure. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. But they, they do it, like right? It. Yeah. So, I, I do it. I'm a warden. <laughs> my, my god kids know I don't play. Like, oh lord. We, oh gosh. But it's love. Like they love me to death. But you know, you still gotta give them. That guidance, yeah. Because they're not. What, I mean, what are you gonna do? Sit back and get mad because of how they acting? Mm -hmm. But you didn't do nothing. To but you didn't do it? anything. Oh my gosh! Snap! Like, snap. It's, just, <laughs> yeah. it's just simple. Yeah. That's why I said a lot of things are just simple, just things to do, and we're choosing not to. And I say we as a just a. Okay. I would say a whole. Mm -hmm. I would say the nation, I, the country, whatever. Like <laughs> as a whole, it's not even just Baltimore City. Please understand all that we're seeing going on. Um, it is not just a Baltimore City thing, and it didn't just happen. It's just that social media is taking control. But one of the things that I enjoy seeing, um, and I know you were there, but let me get you there. I know you had something going. She gonna be at the next. Oh, the but, boys and men. But the boys and men. Men, <laughs> the boys and men seminar was just that phenomenal was, I really because. We gave like when we were coming up with the agenda, we gave like a little sesh, sec, um, section that we, I think it was she may have gave twenty or thirty minutes. I don't can't remember, but we were we literally said just give them that portion because we didn't think they were going to talk. And Only for them to do the breakout, <laughs> and they talked and they talked, and I'm checking mm -hmm. in like y'all yeah. right, and yeah. they needed more time, and they just said that part is what they really liked. Awesome. And it was a group of young young guys in the room with, uh, you know, their examples and their their um, the speakers that were there and they were talking. But they said mainly they were talking to them. And so a lot of times, like I said, we can say all day long what they what they don't want, mm -hmm. what they don't need. But yeah. they clearly showed us and was looking forward to the next one. That's awesome. And, and see y'all for the record, the only reason I wasn't <laughs> at the Boys and Men seminar was yeah. because I know you had some, I the you Urban dead. League. Shout out to the Urban League. Yeah, I saw they that. They booked me to do a leadership I a, saw a, that. A, um, leadership session that same day. I like, saw during that same time. So that's where I was at. I'm but, not I'm not gonna lie. When I saw that, I was like, mm. Hey, mm. the bro code <laughs> did put me on the books. They're having a, a um a retreat, a leadership retreat yeah. for the boys. Mm -hmm. So they booked me on that. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to close them out on that Sunday. Okay, good, so good, good. I will, yeah, that's why I, I was like when it. I saw. I was like, yeah. I'm <laughs> But it's all right. We had to, we had to learn to share, learn to share, you know, and, and work together. <laughs> just kidding, just kidding, <laughs> just kidding. You but look, me all the time. Right? <laughs> yeah. so the next uh, boys and men seminar is going to be Saturday, February the twenty fourth. I hope I have Douglas, these. right? I hope I have That's these right dates. Up the from now. Yeah. So Saturday, February twenty fourth at Douglas. I don't know if it was kind of this robbery going on with the schools. So like Marvel had, it, and so the principal at Douglas was like, "Wait, wait, wait! You know, I want to do it." <laughs> so I said, "All right, and calm see the down." Two weeks I'm just I'm kidding. To do I a workshop. All right. Oh no, no, stop <laughs> it. <Jonah>. What time? <laughs> <laughs> you, you better split Joni. I know. Oh, <laughs> Joni. Yeah, exactly. Joni. Get with the government. Joni. Joni. Oh man, um, what time are you supposed to be there? 
This is supposed. This is supposed to be a nine to four mm-mm, session. Mm-mm. At Weston High. Uh, I am not part of this conversation. All right. Hey, I'm gonna. I'm gonna just look at myself. <laughs> hey, girl. Um, because that's not good. I know, man. But it's, but it's okay. You know why? You know why? Why? <laughs> it's good because. You're still impacting somebody. Sure. And it's good because we're going to be doing this monthly. Oh, that's awesome. That's yeah, awesome. Got, you got March. I got March. <laughs> I got March. Oh, yeah, right we got to make sure we get dates like right <laughs> now. <laughs> so yeah, listen. Right now. See, these dates was locked in months ago. Like, yeah. So, like before the Christmas holiday. <laughs> so this is something we're trying to do. We're trying to have hopefully by the next, by the February 24th date, if we can have at least two days to go out or something, you yeah. know, a place for the next one. Mm-hmm. We we thought about doing that. And let me just say, um, shout out to Nadia because she originally came to me and said this is what she was trying to do. Um, just helping, can, can help with, you know, connection, connecting her with uh, different um, organizations. And so it, it came easily. Hey, can you help? Can you help? But they all were like, yeah, I'll help, you know. Wow. And so after that, even in the, I would say in the process of it, Hello. right before the event, I said, I had a dream. <laughs> Martin Luther King, right? <laughs> I had a dream, and my dream was that God says, this is not going to be the first one. Mm. And he says, take this and do a tour mm. throughout the city. And she was like, whoa, I receive it. So that's how it's happened. It started at the church, awesome. and then we had the school. We have another school. We have a rec center in place. And, well, awesome. two rec centers actually in place. And um, if we could just lock in the dates, that's what we're going to do so we can make sure that you, oh, yeah. you know, put things on your planner. Oh, and, yeah, I'm on And good. So <laughs> I, I wanted to say while we were on that and we talking about the, the youth thing, um, I want – I had to make sure that I said this correctly – I want to shout out, first of all, all of our organizations, all the organizations that are supporters of the of the uh, Boys and Men Seminar. Phenomenal, phenomenal, phenomenal. So I'm hoping I don't miss anyone, so I'm going to have to look at that flyer. But I do want to say that we just had another person or oh, another organization um, be a part of this. Hey. Awesome. And they want to do every month. Wow. So I said, wow. you want to do this month? No, I want to, we want to do every month, and they want to incorporate, and they want to incorporate wow. something in it that's gonna be phenomenal. But I'll wait till the flyer oh, comes. Hey. <laughs> hey. Hey. But look, shout out to Hassan Diggs and the entire Black Professional Men Incorporation. Uh, they are looking forward again to a partnership with Restoring the Village Project. What can we do was the question. I told them, hey, this is a, I told them about the boys and men. This is a start where you can help. It's already in place. And wow. anything else that you would like to do and the emails and the, the calls are coming in. And um, I and, and understand <laughs> I, it's been a lot going on. <laughs> but um, I, I'm going to be going, getting back to uh, making sure that I uh, respond to the, to all of the emails and phone calls. Lord Jesus, take the will. You have, you have something for that <laughs> or assistant that we can yeah, share. No. <laughs> but, yes, Black Professional Men Incorporation yes. um, are doing some amazing things. They are also looking into community building and partnering up with different organizations. So we are honored to have them um, as a uh, partner. That is awesome. Hey. I'm doing a session with them next month. Really? Oh, yeah. oh my god. Oh yeah. We on it. Mm. You on top. Mm. <laughs> Did you see how this kind of works? It's like a circle. We support <laughs> What's each it? other. Yes. That movie? It's like a circle. We support each other. And didn't even know. I didn't know. Didn't even know. But yeah, so so he he called and and it was on and and shout out to um, restoring the village uh, core member um, Monique. Uh, Monique is doing some amazing things. Okay, Monique Brooks. Oh, I would have said ask Monique. We got two Monique, <laughs> yeah. so we got to say ask Monique and Monique. <laughs> but Monique, Julie, uh, Monique Brooks is doing some amazing things. She's actually working with an organization. More information will be followed. Okay. This will kind of go with, with our TV. Group chat. <laughs> yeah, the group, chat, the group chat be lit. Okay. But we have a meeting. <laughs> we just need to <laughs> add you. <laughs> we just need to add you for our youth, okay? Just don't get mad when you keep getting ding, 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 
Hey, <laughs> no, no. I got my notifications. We do not, we do not ding ding all the time. My notifications. It's just be that when off. we start dinging, <laughs> my notifications. Be oh, <laughs> she should know. If I'm responding, it's because I'm purposely going to check. You know, sometimes I, I get. Uh, I know. <laughs> <laughs> that thing might ding 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 ding. <laughs> But you're not just special. You can always get through. You it sound like you a casino, right? <laughs> you can always get through. Two o'clock like in the morning. You, you get through. Yeah, I don't sleep, so sometimes nah. sometimes my messages may come at two o'clock in the morning. But I'm gonna get better. I'm she gonna be get better. Like I'm thirty four o'clock. But I never I be, never sleep. I never sleep. It. I'm gonna I'm gonna work on it one day. It's fine. Not today. <laughs> it can't keep me awake. Not so, so today. Julie, Julie, Monique, um, she's doing some amazing things um, behind the scenes. And I wanted to acknowledge her for all of the great work that she's doing. She's actually partnering up with an organization in D.C. Wow. to bring a program here. And this uh, Sunday, unfortunately, I couldn't make it to this meeting. <laughs> But um, <laughs> I'm about to say Sunday. this, sun, this Sunday, yes, this Sunday she's gonna be meeting with a a, a big organization, a museum at that, wow. to bring in this uh, partnership with Restoring the Village, the museum and the DC um, program. Wow. It is so far looking so good, and um, people are excited, nice and um, it's gonna incorporate youth, and so I would love to have Joni. Be a part of that. It's amazing. I'm already a part. Yeah, you're part of it, right? Yeah, so we're and this is citywide. Like everything we're doing is. Let me tell you, I don't know the last time that we did something. It was just the RTV. I never want no one to think that restoring the village project is a one man show or one organization trying to. You know, I, I don't get into that. But what we try to do is show that us working together can really do some big things. Exactly. You know, amazing. And we don't. Amazing. We just keep trying. And everybody that's a part of um, Restoring the Village as advisors or core, I don't know what kind of titles we're going to give right now. But they all have their own organization, all have their own things, and we, we support one another. But all of our initiatives that we do, mm -hmm. it is about building partnerships, building community partnerships. And so far, it is it is simply amazing. Man, you are when literally I, when restoring I, the village. <laughs> yes, and that's, <laughs> what, that's what we're trying to do. You're not trying. That's what, that. yes, not trying. that's what you're doing. Yes, not trying. Thank you. That's what you're doing. It takes the village to raise a child. It's going to take a village if, if she get another piece of this candy. <laughs> <laughs> it's going to take a whole entire... <laughs> Village here if this child I need to move it. Uh, yeah, I think so. I think we're gonna move it. So yeah, um Godfather. Godfather, came, Uncle Diamond K just you know, he came and oh, gave her no. one piece and now and she's she just took it to the hole. That's how you do it. You got slammed down. <laughs> <laughs> That's how you do it. Okay. Uh, see? Chocolate. Yes. <laughs> when I when I met Joni when I met Joni, and we just got to do some history here. Let's first say shout out to Shelly. Hey, Shelly. Because that's how we, <laughs> that's how we met. Yeah. But um, Shelly helping hands, doing some amazing things. He was just um, on the radio, was right? He awarded? Was awarded yes. something, right? Cool. So I saw um, that he was on the uh, 192Q. And so big shout out to, uh, to Shelly for doing some amazing yeah. things in the community. <laughs> Let's see. And so if she get another one, she's going to be off the chain. But um, <laughs> so we met, and um, it, it has been an amazing journey ever since. Mm -hmm. So, yes, thank you. And yeah. then we met at the business. Um, the business networking forum. Networking. So look all of that. But, so so look at that. for years. No. Like, I was so surprised. Yes. No, <laughs> this is it. Like... This is it. This is wow. this is this is all God's work and 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 supposed to be this way. And that's a testament to you and your relationship building. Oh, like it is good. unprecedented the way you're bringing oh, yeah. people together and just the change that you're making. Like, the next one. For that's sure. The, what what? The next oh, yeah. business network and See what happened was <laughs> <laughs> what happened was I, I, what happened? I know, I ain't but here. I ain't here. Busy. It wasn't me. It wasn't me. Miss Nikita. Oh. <laughs> I'll put you on oh, blast. I, oh man. Form caterers. Oh man, here come the bus. <laughs> so now what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna have to send her a message and be like, hey, you know, you gotta make sure you we do do something. But no, she's um she's doing some phenomenal things as well, and um hopefully we do another networking. I love I love net. First of all, I might be the crazy one, but I love um 
networking events i love meetings <laughs> isn't that stupid <laughs> I love community no, meetings. Love meetings. I <laughs> love community meetings because that's part of networking. Shout out. I'm about to give all kinds of shout out. Shout out oh, to yeah. Shane. Shane is the president of, uh, let me, I hope I get this right, Lakeside and Edna Gardens. Um, Gardens and um, sent me an a, a amazing email. I wasn't at work today, so when I'm off, I'm kind of. So Shane Shane Bryan sent me. He's the president of the Lakeside and Edna Gardens um, Association. Um, it's in District Forty Three, ah! and um, it is near Mervo. And he sent a, a wonderful email about partnerships. Wow! With the community associations, schools, Mervo, and said I just wanted to make sure you're linked in. That is a that is amazing. I just met him. You know, wow. so when people wow. see when people That's see that mm -hmm. and and they want to show, and we're gonna make sure we have a meeting with Joni involved him. <laughs> okay. Joni, she know she fire. know why I'm saying that. Yeah, I won't put nobody <laughs> under the brush, <laughs> but. But yeah, why. but I'm yeah. just saying that's how that's how it goes when you're when you're out, you're meeting, just unselfishly just doing the work, not for that's no recognition. And I mean, it's, it's selfless, wonderful to do it, selfless. but when somebody just does it, just because yeah. you know. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And so that's that's why you're gonna continue to just. That's why this is gonna go further and further and further and further. Right. What you're year. doing, going further and further and further, and um, hopefully with me. <laughs> Ah, one the and sometimes when now I'm getting ready to go off of the song you sent me, but sometimes it can be so um, straining and so much thing, so many things going on. But you said I just can't quit. You right? Mm -hmm. yeah. And so quitting is not an option. And yes, when it starts to get really like, whew, you know, like you know, like that, you know, you have like that pimple, and it's just like right there. That's how it is with life sometimes. And when things are going well and things are going good and you're getting close to something big, it's just like forming, yeah. you know? Yeah. And so we got to make sure that we don't give up. Don't give up. Don't give up. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> I told her I wasn't going to cry here. But um, it, it's a lot. When a, when a lot of things are going on, understand that without you, and not to say like it's this whole ego thing, but without you, you don't know who you're affecting by giving up. So you got to keep going. Because without you, that person behind you or looking at you, it's, a, it's certain people that say, I'll, I've been watching you. Some people just want to help, but they want to make sure, are you okay? You know, are you good? Are you good? And now it's like, I've been watching you. So I'm like, dang, I didn't even know. And you can just tell, because even with us just knowing each other, just, I mean, in what, the last six months, <laughs> you can tell the vibe. Like, you can, I can talk. And she asks me, sometimes like she'll shoot me a message like you okay today and you know you can just tell so it's never it doesn't take that much time to look beyond yourself and just send a quick message or send something i might be send able something. not to pick up the phone and talk to you for an hour but i know that that song does something for me so i know that in that moment it would do something for somebody else like, right and yeah. i can't be there to hug and kiss but you know <laughs> i sent a song she said she saw that song because i was like i, I was like song. oh my gosh i love it i love it in fact i love it so much that I want to incorporate it in an uh, event that I'm doing. And um, this, I don't know if it's like just me having a lot of, we're, gonna, we're just going to vent for a minute because <laughs> I can do it. <laughs> you the host, so you got the floor. I want to <laughs> vent. Right. I want to vent like, I think prior to, you know, I kept saying this has been a, like a rough time for me with my, my dad's birthday was yesterday and his death date is coming up. And all of that is very hard as as well as when you're doing stuff for the community and you're you're you're, you're straining yourself mm -hmm. and to the point where you're like it's, look mm -hmm. let me tell y'all let me tell y'all i no said i said no more no more mm -mm. i sat there yeah, yeah. and i said i am not gonna be on facebook <laughs> but but then is there is there a way to show that you're not on it <laughs> <laughs> so I sh I was on it, and then all the messages start coming, so I pulled back off. But it's like it's so much, so many things can like really drain you from doing 
the work sometimes, but you got to make sure that you do that self-care. So I'm really big on that right now, yeah. as well as um, this year we're trying to do, I'm not trying, I can't stop saying try. Um, this year, this year we will be doing a benefit banquet for my husband. So it's like a 15 year anniversary. Awesome. So it's a lot of things going on um, that uh, last Wednesday I, I spoke at the, um, West Wednesday, so shout out to um, Tawanda Jones. I have spoke at the West Wednesday um, because her brother was murdered, um, and it was a police involved shooting. I mean, um, um, incident. So I spoke there, but what I what we left there with is one is when I speak, sometimes that brings a lot of things up for me. And when I spoke with Tawanda Jones and with the West Wednesday, um, I said over and over, but Tawanda Jones was the one who called me to okay, tell me now. about my husband. You know, so when I speak about it, these things are, it can be encouraging to someone, but it's like me revisiting something mm -hmm. over and over again. Mm -hmm. So um, it, it, when, I, when we talk about, you know, taking a village, I am really, truly grateful for <laughs> She's patting me. <laughs> I'm really, really grateful for, um, you know, the, the village because you never know a simple song or a simple hey or, you know, it, that can really change a person's mood. And it really did because I was, I was like, you know what? <laughs> I didn't want cancer on the same, on a day of, but yeah. it, it's really hard. So, yeah. And I think a Ooh, lot of people struggle oh, with Jesus. that, especially people who are doing so much for others. They kind of struggle with that, but um, I definitely would like to say to anybody that can relate to Angie's story, I'm going to remind you of something that someone had to remind me of, and that is you cannot pour from an empty cup. Ooh. So mm. if your Man, cup mm. is empty, if your cup is bone dry, mm. how are you going to give anything to anybody else? Everybody's going to be thirsty. Oh, my gosh. So you have, <laughs> yes. to, be, you have <laughs> to be the first person that you take care of. And for people like us who have big hearts and who want to give and who want to oh. care for everybody, it's hard for us to do that. But we have to. We have mm -hmm. to always put ourselves first. And um, I came to that realization for myself um, like early last year because um, – a lot of people don't know this, but when I first started, like I was doing a lot of things for free mm -hmm. and, you know, not even because I wanted to, but because it was for me, I'm doing this because this is my calling. This is mm -hmm. what I want to do. I'm not in it for the money. I guess mm -hmm. your assignment. But at the end of the day, I still got a mortgage to pay. I still had bills to pay. And then I really had to take that hard look at myself and think about, okay, some things are going to have to change because if I'm homeless mm -hmm. and if I'm unable to take care of myself, then who am I really going to be able to affect? How many right. lives will I really be able to change? So, and I'm um, so glad you definitely. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> you, monster in yeah. Head. You have to. <laughs> and, and it's yes. still not about monster. the money, but the thing is now the money get to chase me a little bit. Mm -hmm. So it's not so much as me looking for the next job. Now people are calling me and emailing me. So, you know, it's just been a blessing. And I just couldn't be more thankful for the people who are around me who mm -hmm. really helped to make those things happen. Yes. I am um, I am sitting here, um, like I said, it, it's, it's needed to encourage one another. Mm -hmm. um, it was a uh, so it was it was actually several uh -uh. no 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 it was actually several um individuals <laughs> yes the candy <laughs> several individuals that made this notion but um as you all know with the baltimore um news group um so i was added as a moderator on there to add and it was pretty much like at first i thought like am i getting on people nerves when you you add you know share things here and there and they were like keep it going Wow. Keep it going. Here you are. You are, you know, you, you can, whatever you want to put on there. So, um, like I said, it, it could be, this is, could be small, but the thing is, like, you never know who you're encouraging yeah. and, and sharing your, your knowledge, your, your, your heart, but also making sure that you have that self-care. So it was, is on times and, and occasions where I have to say, give me a moment. Yeah. And when I say give me a moment, it is serious because I never... I don't even know if you've seen this so part of me since the six months, but this is like a um, when I just say I, I'm not good, I'm really not good, you know. So, um, but will it be okay? It definitely yes, it will. will. 
Will I, will, will, will we as a community, will we get there? You know, I've had, I've had people say, well, you know, I'm, you're wasting your time trying to say restore the village, but to do any justice for, for Baltimore. So the fact that, yeah, we have this award show coming up. Yeah. We have great things going on with our youth. It's just the fact that you don't know about it. <laughs> and that's why I can tell them. I'm like, you just don't know all the good things. Like, I'm not just saying this to make you feel good. Like, it's amazing things going on. So to hear the young men for the Boys and Men Seminar was great. It made uh, it, it helped us. And not only when I told her that this is, we could do a tour, it, was, it took a young man in that audience to say, will there be another one? Wow. I, he may have been 14 or something. I don't know. And then a 10 year old, did you see the video? Did you he see the video? So did you he see the video? So uh -uh. I have to show you that. Show a 10 year old, he wanted something to say. He's like, and so we were like, well, what is he going to say at 10? What he said was, wow. You know, it was amazing to hear him speak the things that he said. It's awesome. So I'm going to share that. He this. recited back. Oh, he, he, he gave he a summary it. back of the, it's like everything Stop. that he took back from the event. Everything. Wow. Everything. Like, okay. it was awesome. No babies are not awesome. empty. Yeah. I was at the greeting table. Wow. Like, man, I wish I was inside. <laughs> yeah, I had, to, I had to come back and say, I'm sorry, my bad. You know, yeah. come on in. But it was I, I I missed it and I apologize. I was like, Lord, I didn't miss everything. But and come on. Speech. Yes. Oh, yeah. Was, Did you see that, that one, right? That no. was powerful. Joni, that what's going powerful. on, Joni? I got to catch up. <laughs> Do you, are you following me on Facebook? I am, but you know what? <laughs> you know how some people unfollow? Because I unfollow a few people. Yeah, I don't I see them on my timeline no more. So no, I, I'm I have afraid. only one person that I unfollow because I know he's a nice guy. <laughs> I know he a nice guy, so I ain't want to delete him, but I had to unfollow him. Yeah, I unfollow I unfollowed a few people. people. I unfollowed a few people because I, I didn't want to be mean to, to, you know. I don't care about being him. mean. I'm going to unfriend you. <laughs> Except for this one dude, because I know he means well. He Joni, just misguided. Joni just helped me. So I just unfollowed him. But he the only one that get that privilege. Anybody else? Did he? <laughs> You Look, control, go. control, all delete. Yeah, you gotta go. You, you gotta go. I, I am, I am working on that all together. I'm like, we have them. I'm making sure that I am just unfollow. I don't see them, and and it's okay. And it's all off. good. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you, make room. Make room like, for, for positive the people. Take them off. Yeah, they take another yes, spot. This child, <laughs> this child <laughs> had candy and and range. <laughs> Come here. Cut them Dis off. Disconnect the line. Yeah. I think I put on there on my post, I said something about um, the disconnection. Hold on. Cause, I don't even cause, know that. Wait a minute. Because that thing, that thing helped me. I saw somebody <laughs> post. It said sometimes I got, you know, you know this is on my, it need to be pinned. Can I pin it? <laughs> it says sometimes you have to cut the cord just because you forgive someone doesn't mean that you need to keep the connection. Amen. Yes. Just keep it. Just I mean, just cut it. Just cut the cord. You have to. You have you to protect. Cut. You need to yeah. cut. Just <laughs> like that. Just yeah. like that. Yeah. Yeah. We gotta protect our energy and protect our space. Oh my goodness! Yes, yes. To tell you. yes, 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 yes. Mm -hmm. Oh my gosh. So again, um, evening among young stars. And I'm going to yes, let you say the name of the... Um... <laughs> it is An Evening Among Young Stars Awards. Yeah, where's my baby? Because <laughs> I don't want no trouble. <laughs> <laughs> no, we are going to go today. So it's at Lacey Hughes Community Business and Resource Center, 5011 Arbutus Avenue, Baltimore, Maryland, 21215. Park Heights. Park Heights. <laughs> whoop, 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 whoop. Yeah, yeah. At Sunday. 4 o'clock. Yes. Please be there on time. Yeah, I will be there. Add CPT time in there, but please be on time. Hey, can you tell me the menu? Oh, is it the menu? Oh, yes, we having food. <laughs> oh, I'm gonna say that's I don't know that part. That's what's gonna get you That's how that's what's gonna get there. You that's how you gonna get. That's yeah. how you come. You all go. Wait a minute. She was like, yes. Um, <laughs> you know, yes, the whole on a Sunday too. That's dinner time. Like, first of yes. all, I'm, I love looking at. You cute or whatever. <laughs> and she cute or whatever. She cute or whatever. So I need to find. A, I need to find a nice dress to I be the host of the month. The one you sent me, you didn't. I'm not fooling with her. And um, maybe my have my hair pinned down. 
She said the mayor's going to be in the building. <laughs> and um, the state's attorney and all them. So I have to make sure that I'm on my best we behavior. Are, I was listening to that on the way here. What is it? Uh, Maze, uh, Maze and Bay. Oh. Maze and Beverly and Francis. We, we are one. Oh, wait a minute. And, the, and wait a minute, the DJ. Yes. You, oh, my God. Yeah, don't, don't. She... If there's anybody else that's coming that I'm more excited about, <laughs> it's DJ A Easy. Hey. That little baby, she is We awesome. gotta get her on the show. We gotta get her on the show. Mm. Contact contact her. Yeah. Follow on Instagram, Facebook, and You heard of her? her you heard of her diamond game? Yeah, she's gonna be here. Oh, see. Oh. They already got us. Dang. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm on the phone. Okay. That's yeah, but she's gonna be the DJ for the event. So mm-hmm. I'm really excited. Awesome. I'm trying to get a lot of Youth involved yes. mm-hmm. for my vendor, yes. so we have her as a DJ. We have Brianna, um, Pixie photography. Pixie photography. Yeah. She's 16 and she's gonna do the photo booth for the 14. pictures. Oh, photo booth. Oh, 14. Okay. <laughs> Sorry, Sorry Brianna. I'm like, <laughs> Yo, she gonna like it. She gonna like it. You know they little little bit older. <laughs> her mom goes like, no. <laughs> uh-uh. <laughs> Don't tell it. You hit. You see me over here laughing, but still giving her eyes. <laughs> Baby All right, Wild yeah, award. baby Wild is Wild baby award. Wild is ready to lay down we now. Actually, she was asleep when she came in. Yeah, we gonna have a Wild award. We, we need a Wild award. Until he gave her candy. <laughs> <laughs> God, Uncle over here. <laughs> yeah, because you know, put in oh, the trash. Man. Clean Play up, clean candy. up. <laughs> 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 All right, we're going to be wrapping this up very shortly. So, that's right. I can't, no, no. Inside voice, Dora. That's right. Tear it up, tear it up, tear it up. You need, you, need, you need to bring her to Messy Fridays. Messy, what's that? On Friday. That's where we have where a lesson it? about leadership and entrepreneurship, no, 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 but then we make a where whole big mess to drive the message home at Matthew A. Henson hey. Elementary School. Okay. Go ahead. You so, be this Friday, Friday, we're doing you know, it a little early. So, what is it? Early. Um, is it every Friday? Um, every yeah. other Friday. I don't know nothing about this. How, how come we're still in the village didn't know? Well, because it is, it is <laughs> exclusive. She got a busy schedule. She is relaxing. It is exclusive to the fourth graders Aww. there. Um, we have adopted the fourth graders there. Um, oh, okay. And it's just a beautiful thing. Is that where I'm you were on the table? this one outside of. Oh. Just this one. <laughs> she's special. Yeah, she's, she's special. Wait a minute. So, she would love is that it. why? Is that the place you were when you were standing on the table? Because you—that was the first question. And no, you... <laughs> that one, and that particular one, I do that a lot more times than not. Oh. But it just so happens that I had my photographer there, Bree, because um, she can't accompany me to all of my jobs because, of course, she's still in school. But mm-hmm. when I do weekend events, I always take her to bring pictures. But that was at the C School of Maryland. That oh. picture and I had a lot of fun with them. To me, See? that I had the right keynote speech. <laughs> you were standing on top of that table. I said, oh, yeah, she, she going to get them. That's what we did. That's what <laughs> she was the right one. <laughs> yeah, See, yeah, shout out to C School because they're, they're part of um what we're trying to bring here. Absolutely. As well. Shout um, out to Dr. So really, Rice. They're I'm doing really some excited. amazing things over there. No. All right, we're gonna um, we're gonna wrap up. He don't even have to give the key. Yep. Hey, but <laughs> anybody hiring me for a session? That's what we gonna do. Hey. She had she had lots of Starburst um and a, and a piece one? of chocolate. I don't even know if her face is chocolatey. I'm trying to keep this face like <laughs> not as much no more. Yes, yes, yes. So it's it's gonna be from four to eight um, this Sunday, February the 11th. Um, again, it's a, an evening among Young Stars Awards. Thank you, Erica, for coming yes. in. Jernigan. Jernigan. I just want to make sure that I always say that correctly. And thank you, Joni. Always a pleasure. And is it Ha? Hollifield. Okay. Yes. See, I, I, I want to make sure. I, I want to make sure. I want to make sure. Everybody mess it up. It's okay. I never. I no, I, that's why I said Ha. But I was like, I want to make sure because I was like, I don't remember it being on Holyfield. Uh, <laughs> and that's how I, I remember, like, never to say it that way. But anyway, um, thank you, um, Erica and Joni, for coming on the show to talk about life, to, yes. to give encouragement, and yes. to talk about the um, event for this Sunday. I'm excited to host this event. I'm excited to be alongside our visionary yes. and our keynote speaker, the DJ, and everyone who's played a part in this. Thank you so, so so much we'll make sure that we will tag everyone we'll make sure that we will um 
keep everybody abrupt so what's going on because you can still get your tickets. Oh, yeah. yeah. Let's talk about the, that. The, and um, how can they get it? The deadline is not until the 9th, which is Friday. Mm-hmm. Um, so you Pay can that. buy them on event. <laughs> 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 you ain't supposed to tell the market is <laughs> yeah. No, but it's yeah. Friday, uh, February 9th. Um, they'll end. The tickets are only $15 for adults, $10 for kids. We definitely will be um, having dinner involved. And <laughs> it's going to be fun. Sunday and dinner. definitely shout out to Youth Educational Services, Mr. Mitchell, and Neighborhoods United and RTV. So we definitely can't wait. It's going to be fun. I'm excited. I'm excited too. It's time, but I'm excited. <laughs> <laughs> I just can't wait for the event to come. <laughs> I, I'm just excited to, to see her smiling because she said she wasn't feeling good. So, <laughs> wait, wait, girl, I didn't drink by a gallon of ginger tea trying to make sure I was together by Sunday. <laughs> yes, yes. So, um, next week we're going to have. Again, just amazing guests throughout this. Uh, we're going to have Black Wolves. We're going to have Minister Carlos Muhammad. Um, not next week, but this this month. And um, this is going to be all in cooperation with the Black History Month. So we're awesome. thankful to be honoring our young scholars yeah. and um, having different organizations come on to talk about yeah. their um Th- their investments into our community. So thank you all for tuning in today for the show, Restoring the Village Project, RTV Project. We're on Facebook at RT- well, Facebook Restoring the Village Project. Um, and we're also on Instagram and Twitter. I'm learning to tweet, tweet, tweet. Well, you back to me. <laughs> um, I can't tweet. <laughs> so we're on uh, Instagram and Twitter at RTV Project 1. And I think that's all. And then our website, www.rtvproject.org. We are looking for um, individuals who or businesses who would like to sponsor our show. Your information will come along um, the show, and it will be shouted out throughout different groups and um, organizations and on our um, website. So truly excited for an amazing, another amazing show and looking forward to many more. Thank you all. Have a good night. Good night, y'all. Good night. See y'all Sunday. Yes, he's okay. <laughs> Four o'clock shop. Don't be late. Well, he's already <laughs> on. <laughs>